it was a little over three years ago, I was on a plane and um, on my way to Des Moines and I was sitting next to a businessman and we were having the nicest conversation. And uh, you know, he was telling me about his new house and his children and their sports teams. And, and then he said to me, why are you going to Des Moines? And I said, well, I'm going to speak at a women's leadership mm -hmm. conference. And suddenly this lovely man looks stricken. He gets that kind of deer in the headlights look. And he, he's like, sorry, I'm a man. And um, proceeded to tell me he had just been through diversity training. Mm -hmm. And the diversity training he felt like was, you know, a couple of days worth of getting beaten over the head and, um, you know, put in the corner, called to the principal's office. And he said the message that he took away from this training was, it's all your fault. And those words really stuck with me because that is exactly the opposite message that we should be giving to men. We should be talking about like how do we bring men in, not how do we alienate them. So the next day I was speaking to a ballroom full of women mm -hmm. about all of the issues that we do face that are serious issues that we must solve for um, that are systemic issues. And I'm seeing a, a room full of female heads nodding in a, a, you know recognition. And I just stopped in the middle of a sentence. I said, you know what? We know this. We actually need men in this room to hear this as well.